Hello, I'm Chardo. This time, uh, I'm gonna show you the how to upgrade RAM and SSD uh, for the uh, Asus X505 ZA dash BQ475 laptop computer. So, also it is including the USB booting setting in the BIOS menu. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, here's the uh, uh, the specification for the uh, this uh, Asus Vivo Book uh, laptop computer. So this is the uh, uh, CPU uh, AMD Ryzen 5 2500U. Uh, the default frequency 2.0 gigahertz. Uh, it will be max uh, operation with the 3.6 gigahertz. Right. So and also the memory, the four gigabyte DDR4, uh, can be uh, added the uh, the 16. So total uh, memory will be the 20 gigabyte. Okay. So and also the graphic, uh, it is integrated on the CPU, the Radeon Vega 8 graphics. Okay. Let's uh, move to in detail. Okay, yeah, this is op uh, open the display. Okay, uh, this is the 87 key uh, on the keyboard. Alright, so, this is the blue. Okay, next. Okay, this is the bottom side of the laptop computer. Okay, and so this is the product label on the bottom side. Alright. Okay, this is the left side. Uh, you can see the I input output port. Right. Okay, this is the, the power jack, the LAN jack, the HDMI, USB. Okay, this is the, the Type C USB port. Right. Then this is the, the right side I port. Okay. Right to USB the and the headphone jack the SD card. Right. Okay. Uh, to uh, take it up the the this uh, uh, laptop. So totally the eleven uh, screws need to be removed uh, from the, the each body. Okay. So uh, after remove the, the the screw or the eleven screws, the, uh, this is the, the main board side, right? But uh, as you can see, the uh, the SSD uh, can be upgradable, but uh, uh, the M.2 SSD and the RAM is uh, not too easy to upgrade. So uh, it need to be taken off uh, from this body. Okay. okay. So uh, this is the uh, remove the the keyboard assay assembly. Okay. Yeah. This is the FSDB cable for the. Uh, this is the keyboard. This is the uh, mouse uh, touch pad. Okay. So uh, to disassemble. The, the keyboard part firstly the uh, uh, remove the uh, there are two uh, FPCB, FPCB cable from the uh, member okay okay yeah this is the touchpad connector and this is the keyboard uh, connector right. so also this is the Wi-Fi module so this is the, uh, the in the left side and uh, input of a port, including this is the, the uh, mounted on the motherboard. Total the four gigabyte memory. Okay. So this is the uh, um, uh, this is the FPCB cable. Uh, that cracked the right IO port and then the member. Right. So, also, this is the 2.5 inch hard drive. Right. 
ね。Okay. Hey, this is the cooling fan.、Uh, it can be、uh, cooled down、uh, the heat、right? uh, from the generated、uh, the CPU. Okay. So this is the the battery,、uh, the three cell, the 42 watt hour lithium-ion battery. So to take care of the battery,、uh, firstly the unscrewing the this one, then unlock the、uh, this and this. Okay. Alright,、uh, the battery、uh, has been removed、huh, from the、uh, each body. Okay, this is the battery for the、uh, this model. Okay. This uh, uh, after removed the、uh, uh, 2.5 inch hard drive、uh, from the motherboard. All right. Uh, the two、uh, upgraded the RAM and the SSD.、Uh, the motherboard need to be the take it off from the each body. So、uh, screw one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. Yeah, totally seven screws need to be、uh, unscrewing, right? And then the、um, the wire wireless module and the PCB cable need to be removed. Okay. Okay. Finally, uh, the uh, the remove the the motherboard. Yeah, from the、uh, its body. Okay, as you can see that the cooling fan, the SSD, M.2 SSD, the CPU,、uh, the memory socket.、Eh? Right,、uh, this is the memory socket.、Uh, you can upgrade it till the 16 gigabyte. Okay, the including 4 gigabyte、uh, mounted on the me、uh, mainboard, so totally.、Uh, It can、um, the extend it to the twenty gigabyte totally. Okay. Hey, the, this is the, the、uh, M.2 SSD、uh, with the twenty twenty two eighty the form factor. Right. This is just the, the size number, right? You can see. Okay. Yeah.、Uh, this is the twenty twenty two eighty the form factor. Right. This is just the size number, right? You can see. Okay. Yeah. This is the the cooling pan cooling pan assembly. Okay, and this is the,、uh, the 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 bottom side of the member. Okay, and you can see in the left side、uh, there are the port of four gigabyte RAM. And this is the mounted on the member. Okay, and this is the CPU, right? The M the, the Ryzen five twenty five hundred U. Laptop, the processor. Okay. So, the grease、uh, the really hardened, so it is not、uh, fully functional. So,、uh, need to be the、uh, need to be the upright again. Okay. Yeah. This the remove the the hardened the, the grease. Okay, you can say that the AMD Ryzen 5, okay, 2500U, right? Okay, this is the bottom side of cooling assembly. Okay, yeah,、uh, I already insert、uh, the additional、uh, 8 gigabyte RAM into the intersector.、Eh? Okay. Uh, next uh, 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 situation is the, the、uh, how to set up the USB boot in the BIOS menu. Okay. So this is the, the main tab. So you can see the the base information for the uh, uh, this Asus uh, laptop PC.、Eh? Okay. So. Yeah, then you can go to the boot tab, then、uh, go to the boot option number one.、Uh, it is uh, the, uh, already the set 
to the the s the ssd all right so uh, it is uh, the the change to the usb all right send this good After the change the, the USB, so uh, save uh, all the information, so uh, you can uh, see the put from the USB. All right. Yeah, that's all. Thank you for watching this movie. That's all.